So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to make a connection on my air hose with my PEX crimping tool. Normally for plumbing, you know, it's got crimp rings, so um, you're going to have to do a couple of unique things because the size fittings that I have are just a little small for the hose I got. Uh, small fitting, show you what it looks like, normal fitting of the pipe wall. So I'm going to cut off a piece about an inch, about that far. You know how it's done, what plumbers do. Of course you can use a hacksaw if you want. Then what, what you got to do is you've got this ridge on the inside. I'm assuming you have to do it, but you know this tubing cutter comes with a part that allows you to grind out the inside, grind out that ridge. So you got to make it look good so it doesn't cut into your hose. Now me, I'm a little compulsive, so I'm going to use my Dremel tool. <laughs> A little bit of water to cool it down. Okay, next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to slice out of that. I'm going to take my hacksaw and cut about a quarter of an inch out of that. I'm going to cut a little more off. I don't think that's quite enough. This is what I'm. This is what I'm going to do. See a little dimple there. Unless you have to dimple it. This is the one. There's no dimples. That is a bigger fitting. You can see the hose kind of bumps a up a little bit. I had to put some pressure on it to get it in there. This just kind of went in loose. But I'm gonna show you how it's done. Take your fitting. This on and then put the fitting in. Yeah, so that goes good. Then real PEX fitting. Let's see what it looks like. It slides right on. So Take your PEX tool, okay. take your PEX crimper, you can see I got the copper on there, and I always I put the opening on the opening of the tool, I don't know if that's right or not, but it works, so it's got to be some kind of right, then you crimp, and that gives you pretty good joint but you can still spin that a little bit so I mean by hand so I don't like that so what I do is I take another pack of spinning that I had to cut off put it on again I go towards the open side Put the opening at the opening, put it in, get a little crimp, you notice it didn't, I didn't close it all the way, take that fitting off, and you got the little bump, little nipple, I don't know what to call it, you can't spin it. I have tested it and that is a good connection no air leaks um, I didn't haven't tested it to like 150 or anything PSI so just from the guy that hates to have those knobs with the screws sticking out hang on stuff that's a pretty nice fitting if you've got a, crimp, a PEX crimper because the hose end crimpers are like I don't know they're like $300 and um, by the way, I did my garden hose this way. <laughs>